Good morning. It's Tuesday. I just got to the house. Um, as you can see, I'm driving the truck again. Very nice. Very nice. All right. Uh, I just got here. A lot of stuff has happened. Some good, some bad. But regardless, it needs to happen. So, as we notice, back of the house. This pile is all we got left for steel, baby. Get rid of all that crap today, and then the yard will be ridden of all of the Villarreal men's collection of metal objects. <laughs> Repeated metal objects. Uh, Alright, let's go inside. As we come inside, it's a little dark in here uh, and cold. It's starting to get chilly out, so uh, we have some still some piles. Like I have some scrap. This has to go into the shed. This is going to my house. So this has got to go into the shed. Uh, these are the bins that we're getting from outside, and then I have empty bins. That are ready for the garbage because the dumpster's coming this week. Uh, and we need it. So, you can see the house. So, these are all basic empty bins. Empty bin. My sheet metal tools. So, I scanned this box for my drill. I really don't care for it. I'm going back to the bag. Uh, empty boxes. All these are empty boxes. These are all filled with little miscellaneous stupid things. A while ago, but went through it, got rid of a lot of it. A lot of it went to the garbage. Some of it went to Goodwill, though. Uh, my basic tools this is the duct that goes up in the attic, the mattress for using it as a knee pad. We were, I'm gonna throw that in the dumpster as soon as it shows up. Uh, the one table saw, we're gonna keep this. I fixed the legs, I put it all together the way it should be. Uh, I'm going to use this as a job site table saw until we get here. And then this is the tool table that I had last time. My chop saw, my handbag that goes everywhere, some miscellaneous sheet metal stuff that we need to get the duct work done. Uh, so we're, we're doing good. Brought the six footer, big old ladder. But this is the thing that's impressive. Makes me very happy. Very, very, very happy. So I'm going to sweep it up, but I'm not really curious. Uh, too crazy about it because we're going to get rid of the ceiling this week. Uh, it's empty, guys. This It's empty. And this room is empty. Oh, yeah. You know, it was a big deal when the inspector was here. He's like, I can't go to the wall because he. this is what he does. He'll come up to this pipe and grab it right here. See this? It's loose. You gotta tighten it. But he'll go to every single pipe and do that. Make sure that it's tight. It snug as a bug and it doesn't rattle or move. See that a little noise? It's one of these is loose. I gotta go back and double check everything. And I have to put tape to cover up these little holes. Oh, apparently this is fire hazard now, so whatever. Whatever, whatever's clever. Plenty of tape. Uh, we got the bathrooms all cleaned out. So, uh, our next project is going to be, obviously, the, the finish of the demo. Uh, is a fish in the soffit so we can get rid of this electrical service and we can get it where it needs to go. And then we can start patching up the roof. Uh, that's the other reason why we're getting the dumpsters, because we're going to have to do the roof ourselves. Life sucks, but it is what it is. Not the first time. It's just I know it is labor intensive. So I am uh, I'm gonna go start loading up my truck, start moving some of this other crap out of here, and get everything finished up. Maybe even fill up the garbage cans with some of this drywall and insulation. So um, looks good in here.
I'm super happy. It's like starting over again. Got my vibe back. Windows in. I just made my material list, so hopefully we'll get all of that stuff mañana or later tonight. And then we can get this window in maybe this week also. That one. Then we can call the outside done until the roof gets done. Uh, and then we can do the inside. Wrap up the outside, finish up the inside. So things are getting there. Looks good. Uh, you know, we had a lot of hiccups. My I had hiccups, and since I work for myself and I do things by, I'm here by myself. It, it's a huge hiccup for everybody then. So, but uh, we're back on track. Yesterday I had a little issue with the uh, sump pump in my own personal house where it had a bunch of water in there. Total mess. What a nightmare. You know, the sump pump is brand new. That's the other part that upset me. Is I just got it like six months ago. Uh, but it is what it is. That's why you shouldn't store so much crap in the crawl space. So it's all over my living room right now. So that's my problem though. And we'll deal with that when I get home. So I will uh, talk to you guys later. Love you very much. See you soon.